As chairman of the Bowling Green Association, it is a particular pleasure to welcome New York City's Colombian community here for the first time ever to raise the Colombian flag high over New York City. Que viva Colombia! Viva! No, no, we gotta try that again. Que viva Colombia! Que viva! Thank you so much, Arthur, and thank you to the Bowling Green Association for this incredible partnership, more than anything, to celebrate and uplift our immigrant communities. Flags of other nations to fly beside our American flag here at Bowling Green since 1996, when New York City's Greek community donated the second flagpole here. But not until, not until Mayor Adams became mayor a few months ago, has any mayor ever come to Bowling Green to raise flags to honor New York City's global diversity. Very special thanks to Mayor Adams, who will soon be here for once again coming to Bowling Green today and to his Office of Immigrant Affairs, which has become a true partner here at Bowling Green in working to make many of these flag raisings possible. The Mayor's Office of Immigrant Affairs, fabulous. I'd like to acknowledge our Commissioner of the Mayor's Office of International Affairs, Commissioner Mermelstein. Our Commissioner of the Community Affairs Unit, Commissioner Kreisman. And uh, our colleagues in city government who are either Colombian uh, immigrants or children of immigrants. Jose Bayona, Executive Director of the Office of Ethnic and Community Media. Dr. Jonathan Jimenez, Executive Director of NYC Cares. And of course, uh, un colega, un amigo, Alfonso Lopez of uh, the City Legislative Affairs. I am also here. I am also here with Assembly Member Catalina Cruz, Assembly Member Natalia Fernandez, State Senator Jessica Ramos. Julia, Julia, not here. And Council Member Jennifer Gutierrez. So I'd like to introduce to you Colombia's Council General, Susana Berenguer. Our institutions are, and our democracy are the most important assets we have. Today, we celebrate 212 years of independence. Maybe this opportunity to uh, give an homage to our heroes that uh, two, tw 212 years ago uh, celebrated the most important uh, value for any society, liberty. Let me tell you something. Flags are a powerful symbol as exists of human society, and Bowling Green exemplifies that power. As soon as the first immigrants arrived here in the early 1600s, a flag, first the Dutch flag, has flown here at Bowling Green, the place where our city was created. When the British replaced the Dutch here in 1664, the first thing they did was raise the British flag here to fly continuously until the most famous flag-raising event ever in all of American history. On November 25th, 1783, when General George Washington rode into New York City and down Broadway triumphant to declare the successful conclusion of our American Revolution and witness the last British flag still flying anywhere in the United States, removed from right here at Bowling Green and replaced by the original 13-star American flag. Yes, General Washington stood right here that day and is why we still fly the 13-star American flag here year-round. I hope you will resolve to return to Bowling Green to raise the Colombian flag again and again and again, at very least once a year, if not more. 
As a final thought for me today, Mayor Adams, while he has a long list of impressive goals for New York City these next four years, I hope he considers adding a but powerful symbol, Lolly goal to that list. There are more consulates in New York City than any other city on earth, over 100, and more ethnic diversity than in any other city on earth. I hope the mayor considers adding to his goals coming to Bowling Green over the next four years to raise more flags of other nations reflecting New York City's diversity, to fly before our, besides our American flag more than anyone has ever done in history anywhere. The fact is, the mayor is already on his way to reaching that goal by coming here once again to join you in raising the flag. I'm so proud to be here with the Colombian community. And now it is my honor to introduce to you the mayor of the city of New York, Mayor Eric Adams. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Such an important day. Uh, 212 uh, celebration, and we are in area code 212 as we do that celebration, this flag wave raising here in this community, and two of uh, my amazing elected officials that are from uh, Colombian ancestry. This is a proud day for them. When we raise the flag here, at the heart of our uh, financial strength here down at Bowling Green. It sends a real message for the entire rich, prosperous Colombian community that you matter, we see you, we recognize how much you have done for this city. And I think a great reflection of that is Little Columbia in Jackson Heights, where you get great culture, food, music, sound, and great development in that community. So this is a significant day for us. When you look at the great uprising in Bogota uh, that inspired this amazing moment, this amazing day, you should be so proud of your contribution, not only to your homeland of Colombia, but your adopted homeland of America and what it represents. So I am here to simply say that thank you, thank you, thank you, and let's continue to be the diverse city uh, that we are, where everyone comes to find a way to experience this a great Amer American dream that we have. Let's raise this flag, let's raise our spirits, let's raise our city and country. Thank you very much.